Reference diagram enables you to add linkage between model elements and diagrams. While each notation carry a specific kinds of model details, reference diagram allows you to add supplementary details to model elements. For example, a data object invoice can reference to an ERD for describing the structure and properties involved in an invoice, and the wireframe that shows how the invoice look like. Let's see how it works. Let's add a diagram as a reference to the rent a car use case. You just need to click the left bottom corner resource called references and then click the add diagram item. Then the select diagram dialog box will be shown. Just click the process car rental activity diagram. Click OK. You can also add the shape as a reference. Click the same resources icon and click add shape item. Then the select shape dialog box will be shown. You can select the shape staff and tick the checkbox and click OK to add the reference. Now I would like to show you to add a model as a reference. You also click the references icon and click add model element this time. Then you will see the select model dialog box. Select the model you want, the customer, and click OK. The reference will not affect the model structure. You can go to the model explorer tree and you can find the customer class. We just added as a reference. It still sits in the root of the project. You can also reference to external resources like file, folder, or URL. Navigate to reference diagram and elements is easy. You just click the same reference icon and you will see the reference diagram showing on the top of the pop-up. You just click the item and then we will bring you to the reference diagram. Open the reference shape is as easy as the open reference diagram. You just click the same resources icon and then click the shape. Then we will send you to the diagram and select the shapes you reference to. You can also open the model element. You click the model element in the pop-up. Then we will send you to the elements diagram. You can also navigate back from the reference that element. You just click the elements and click the resource icon and click the reference that by item. Then, a reference that by dialog box will be shown. You see who is referencing to you. You just click open to jump back to the source of the reference. You can turn on the model element reference indicator to show which elements has the reference to other elements. Then you will see if the model element has the reference will have the resources icon showing on. The reference information not just available in the tool, it also available in the published document. Let's publish the project. And publish to D drive ran a car doc folder. You can open the use case diagram car rental and you see there is a reference icon showing in and you also click the item to jump to the process car rental. You see the activity diagram is showing up. Thank you for watching this video.